Signs, chants, and a call to unite. Protesters took to the streets of Omaha tonight. Their message loud and clear. They do not support President-elect Donald Trump. Good evening, I'm Craig DeGrelli. Jenny is off tonight. Demonstrators believe there is strength in numbers. New at 10, reporter Miranda Christian is live in downtown Omaha with what happened. Miranda. Yeah, the protest lasted about four hours this evening, and while everyone came out with different reasons, they shared one. They do not agree with Donald Trump being elected the next president. Not my president! A group of anti-Trump protesters continue to chant. Donald Trump has got to go! Hey, hey! Protesters filled the Jean Leahy Mall Friday night after Donald Trump was elected the 45th president of the United States. It's not just, oh, uh, that Hillary Clinton lost to a, a Republican. It's just the fact that Trump has just espouted so many things that I am against. Veteran Stacy Cornell says she knows the decision has been made. I had to come down here and show solidarity to some of these other young people to show you that there's older people too, including veterans. The group marched the Omaha streets, holding their signs and hoping to make a statement. For Alberto, the election of Donald Trump has put fear into him and his family while he waits to become an American citizen. But this time he hurt a lot of people and we, we're scared. People are really scared. Like, I don't know what to do. Like I said, I called my lawyer and she's like, just be prepared just in case. Alberto just wants an apology from Trump. When it started, I believe in Trump. I believe he has the power to turn the economy around. It's just he shouldn't have insulted so much, you know. Within the crowd of anti-Trump protesters stood one man holding a sign that said, you lost, accept it. Well, when Obama was elected, you didn't see this. And he was the only Trump supporter to show throughout the night. I'm the only one out here, but it doesn't bother me. There was no violence between that Trump supporter and the protesters from what I saw this evening. There was, of course, chanting all evening, but everything remained pretty civil. Reporting live, I'm Miranda Christian, KMTV Action 3 News.